that stream though. Ooh, it just worked. It just worked. <laughs> I did some independent research, and it turns out the NPCs that you encounter are, in fact, based on both your monsters on your team, or more specifically their average level, and your inventory. So ever since I got this fat ass level 99 following me around, um, even though he's great, it's been very difficult to find um, certain monsters. So I might as well just use this fucking Dark Dream with really, really good stats at level 10. It's a Lady Dark Dream. And what about money? The current money situation is pretty bad. I'm going to buy some herbs. That is not the herb guy. I need to make sure my inventory is full. I think... Yeah, alright, 24 is the max. I wonder if I can beat this with a single character. Oops, no joy ticky. Ah, nice bang. I don't even know if this guy has healing. thousand the spot king I can't tell if I'm making money or not it looks like I'm dying most of the time no actually it doesn't Looks like I'm winning a good number of them. <laughs> well, I made a lot of money, even though my success rate wasn't that good. Because I only need to win one time for every six times I lose. Certain monsters just fuck me up bad, especially the ones that transform into me. Or the ones that know, like, Bee Dragon and shit. I might have capped my money at this point. That one new be dragon. No, I'm still pretty ways off. A pretty ways off. I don't need that much money though, to be honest. <coughs> Ribs will actually be very useful coming up. I really don't need these rings. Alright, I'm ready to run into some crazy NPCs. <laughs> Cut me off. Oh, there's a traveling merchant. Let me lighten your purse. Oh, this is the this is the bandit. I don't need any of these things. And I should not have fought him. What did he do to fuck me up so bad? Are these monsters not scaled to my level? Why the fuck am I not just attacking? All of my skills are weak as hell. I've got 400 base attack. Yeah, like my normal attack does more damage than... It's no use though. 
The guy's too tough for me. This world is kind of... This world, the world is not scaled to my level. That was him again. I guess I'm supposed to finish this quest, because it's going to affect what I can find. So the king will periodically give you, like a, like a, he'll tell you that someone is raising hell. I can bring along Cloud King. And it, you can take a quest to find that person. There he is. Fugitive was caught and sent back to Great Log. I guess out of curiosity we'll go see the message. Out of my way. Randomly stepping NPCs need to be removed from video games. I got 10,000. Dressed as a priest, that'll be pretty easy. I actually shouldn't have accepted that because I don't need the money. But then again, I can just not accept the money yet. This is just a fun little thing you can do after you've beaten the game. It, uh... There's uh, one of these guys. A different monster stockade. Monsters that I don't terribly need, no less. That is problematic. I didn't think about that. That's a servant. I need that. I still need to make a single Draco Lord. Because there's one monster... Uh, Lazarus or something? Laz Lazamanus? There's one monster that's White King plus Draco Lord. Which means I need another Andriel and another White King. Whoa, did I just get fucked up? Make it stop. All right, kill them. Use the sage rock. No. Nobody dying. Sage rock just break. I thought it was infinite use. Why can I only? Why is God not on the list of monsters I can control? I did not foresee the idea that I c could maybe not even win. Oh, it's because God was shivering. He got sick licked. Quad hits, that's what's fucking me up. I can use this. Whoops. World leave. Well, that was incredible. Alright, I still need the Servant though. Servant still saves me a lot of time. Even though I had to use a World Leaf trying to get it. Is he gonna join or not? So God has healing, I don't even remember that. So I could have just had him set to... Okay, I need to like clearly give this thing another rib, but got it. So I got the servant, and now hopefully he leveled up my team to the point that I can find people with, um, um, 
White Kings, I guess. Maybe that's a bit overly hopeful, though. Find out in a second. Ooh. I recognize that thing. It's in Kobe's Journey. It's not in this game. That was an Orochi. Trumpeter. That's quite good. That mad dragon thing. A lot of tail eaters. I think I think all of these guys are much more common in Terry. Tail eater and the little koala guy definitely. I don't I don't know about Orochi. That mad dragon. That Kotal guy, I think that's actually really good. So I might get that. The one with the funny looking... That thing. Actually, that might be a wing snake. That might be the best thing this guy has. I was hoping for anything undead, but he doesn't appear to have literally anything undead. I want that wing snake. Let's get one of these guys. I don't want the mime slime. What the fuck? What the fuck is this thing? What is it? Didn't even join. No, no mime slime. Damn it! The other two like don't like joining. Mad dragon. I'm going to look up how rare this thing is, and then I'll make a decision regarding capture. Mad Dragon is Gascon plus any beast, or any dragon plus Gulp beast. That is not very rare at all. That is quite common. The wing snake is much harder. So I think I want to capture that. Unfortunately, capturing it uh, doesn't help me catch another similar one. Any dragon plus a mad goose equals a vampirus. I think I'm going to finish the dragons next, because the dragons all look kind of fun and easy. Let's get that wing snake. I'm pretty sure it's a wing snake. It has wings and it's a snake. Female. So I could catch another one of those and then breed them because they are breeding two of them together is probably the easiest way to get a codal. Quatal. You wound me, Devora. Seven AM is not a good time. Whoop, that was a guy. Hey, it's the guy, and he's back for more. Give me another wing snake. If it's the wrong gender, that's extra breeding for me. Naroshi would probably be useful, sadly. Sadly. I want to get a wing snake without, like... A completely stupid battle. This looks easy enough. Wing snake also female. Whatever. Let's breed these two up.
Do I have a dragon? I have an Andriel. It's female too. Need to catch a male dragon. What the fuck dragons are there in the game? I can only think of dragons and andrils. I've got to catch a bunch of dragons too. So where the fuck is a... Don't I have like a region for dragons? Just go to sky, catch a male dragon, everything will be fine. There's a mad goose, I need a mad goose too. That's a female dragon. And catching it again will not do anything. I don't want the medley. Female dragon. Medleys have radically different attack patterns in this game than other games. They're easier to catch. They don't give as much of a fuck. Dragon female. I do not remember the context of the battle that results in a dragon male. Skullroo female. Dragon female. They're both ladies. At least dragons have a high rate of capture. It wasn't that one. Be able to go. Got the fucking mad goose. Didn't even join. Oh, got one. I'm going to try and finish like a family a day at least. And by a family a day, I probably mean way more than that since it's probably going to go pretty fast. Breed my newly acquired. This should result in a wing snake. Hopefully it will be a male wing snake. Nope. It would be nice. Wouldn't it be nice if we were older? Then we wouldn't have to wait so long. And wouldn't it be nice to live together in the kind of world where we belong? I didn't lose. I wish there was a faster way between these regions. It feels like it takes too long. Wing snake. Wing snake. I don't know if Kotal... God damn it. I do not know what Kotal is used for. So I've got to look everywhere. Codal can be used to breed a gate guard. Phrase not found. Phrase not found. Oh. Aquadon is a Digong plus a Codal. And the other things you can use besides a codal are insanely hard. Alright. So I'm gonna go catch a Digong, I guess. If I recall correctly, that's the incredibly cool looking thing. I don't remember what a codal is. I think it's on the cover of Dragon Warrior Monsters 1. I think it's like a recolored wing snake. Where's the red ocean? Is this water? 
Yes. I need to catch a rush fish. Are any of you a rush fish? That was a peacher fish. Technically the hardest, every area is a water area. Except the ones that literally have no water. Here we go. That might be a rush fish. Gamanian. I got fucked. This area is too high level. Oops, I did not plan for this. No, I can't run away. Okay. Alright, time to recruit some monsters into my team that are kind of stronger than these two. Time to bring along the legendary, the man, the myth. My Orgonomir. These are neither Misty nor Depths. Hello, Priest. That is not the Priest I'm looking for. Octo Kid. This might be the Priest. Nope. Huh. I thought it would be easier to find this guy. Well, I caught an Octo Kid. Somehow. A rush fish is an angler on plus a whoa. Why is it so hard to make fish? Petite eel plus any material. Let's get a petite eel. That seems quite easy. That motherfucker. There's a petite eel. Chances of me killing that thing last are negative zero in, in a thousand. I need. To, I have an obligation to talk to all these guys until I can find the one I'm looking for. Uh, my monsters literally kill. Damn it! Why would they ultra slash the one I want to catch? Why are my monsters so uncooperative? All I want them to do is not kill that one. Alright. Kill the rogue wave. And now they kill the... I mean, in their defense, I've never had... Whoa, it killed Luna. I got the petite eel. I had to breed this thing with any material. End quote. Which means I need to go and catch something in white slime is not correct. First thing. That is male. Which should be quite easy. Nothing like having a team of gods. Alright, here begins a long and stupid line of breeding. This petite plus any material, results in an angler on. And then upon capture, the angler on must can be, be combined with any dragon. So I need to catch another dragon. Hopefully a female angler, or a male angler on. There we go. That's a cool looking fish. I'm gonna get it a hot date.
It's a male dragon. When are they ever male dragons? I think dragon by itself is always female. Well, you're safe. Be careful, Waru. There's a rush fish. And the rush fish needs to be bred with a spikerus, a rogue wave, a mad goose. A Gigantis or a Golem. Well, I was finding rogue waves earlier, so I should go catch one of those. The almost everything on there I could get though. All the water monsters is probably the most interesting one I could do, and I think I said I would do it last. It will. That is not a rogue wave. That is a petedial. I would have been happy with that earlier. A clam. I should have caught that thing. I mean, I do need it. This looks good. Rib should do it, because I've never had the monster before. There we go. It's so... I don't like this game on console. I mean, I do, but, like, I hate the capturing system so much. Because you have to just give meat to monsters and just hope they join. So I caught, like, a female wave, if that makes any sense. I need to breed this rush fish to be male. That's apparently a rush fish. I've definitely seen that monster before. I think it's in other Dragon Quest games. In fact, I'm sure of it. One battle should do. It's probably like a 10. It's a 5. Oh, that's really easy. Words. Whoops. None of these skills are cool. Ramming reduces both the ear and the opponent's HP to like single digits, which is really useless because you fight a lot of opponents. It also has a low success rate. But it's useless in random battles, and I don't think it works on bosses, so it's one of those skills. Whoa! Mark territory? Okay, I wasn't expecting that. So this is... this is some weird stuff already. I've nearly made all the really crazy stuff in this category already. I never got the super boss. So I got a Digong. It is male. Be nice if this Kotal was female, but I don't I have my doubts. It's not. So, um, I got a Digong. It looks just as cool as the first time I saw it. I'm still enamored with its, say, uh, its appearance. There it is. It's not a wing snake. It's a 10. This thing's a 10 as well. That was dumb. I just wasted my time. Words. I hate this. Alright. One battle got me to level 10 on both. 
How does he still have Sandstorm even in his move pool? Dagong plus Kotal will be something sick. I don't know if I need this thing for anything, and it's time to look again. Nice noise. Nope. Literally used in no combinations whatsoever. It's just a kind of rare cool monster. I've never seen this thing. Let's look at it. Ooh, it's kind of cool. It's like a dinosaur. Innocent. It's got the boss level uh, leveling system. Very slow leveler. So this is like the rarest water monster besides Poseidon. I suppose. And King Squid is quite rare too. I need an Octogon too, that's going to be hard, but I can just buy the egg for Tiny Metals. Because getting two Octo Reaches to the proper... Whoa, that's hard. You have to have at least plus five with two Octo, octo Reaches to get an Octagon. I need to read two Octagons to get a King Squid. Good thing you can just get a King Squid. I think I'm going to do that now. The forklift training was A-OK. -okay. Let's pick up Baffy. Baffy's one of my favorite mons. Alright, what was I gonna do? I'm gonna take on this super boss. So the super boss is in Pirate. Basically, once you beat Pirate Region, there is one tiny little place, I think like down. It's in a very random spot on the map. Like over here, I think. There he is. So he's here. He's like in a really random spot. He's just kind of chilling. Thick suction cup tentacle snaked out of the whirlpool. Here is King Squid. He is generously harder than Dark. But I brought the pain. Yeah, you can just tell already. Durza was unaffected by water spells. That was pretty rad. Did you see that? He might have some of that uh, super monster immunity. That'd be this thing. He doesn't even give that much experience. King Squid! He's innocent. Tidal Wave, Rain Slash, Penny Dance. Tidal Wave is one of the strongest spells. It's water elemental. I don't think elements do literally anything in this game. I mean, they do. He's a force join, too. He always joins. Well, that was an easy super boss. Um... Now I guess I'm going to catch some of the lesser things. I guess I'm going to go to Great Log. I've used up some items so I can go do the arena. And my goal is going to be produce tiny metals. Got one. I feel like if this game wanted to improve... Okay, okay. So the thing about Dragon Warrior Monsters... The thing about in Pokemon is once you see a Pokemon, it's added to your Pokedex, but it's not fully added. You just show It just shows you the Mon. So, um... 
if you can if you get at least that much, you can look at the monster and you can see its area. The thing about Dragon Quest is it doesn't do anything like that. You have to catch something in order to look it up. And what I think they should do is they should show you something like even if you as long as you've seen it, even if you've never caught it, they should show you something. Not its skills, not its description. They should show you how to breed it. And of course, in the thing, it shows you how to breed it. It only shows you one method of breeding it. And of course, there's many for a lot of monsters. I feel like if they did that, it'd be a lot easier for like people to like breed some of the harder stuff. And then um, it still wouldn't help you find any of the bosses because you don't even run into them. Friend, Life Ring, Meteorb, Magic Key, Attack Seed. Need a tiny metal. There we go. Oh, that shark is red. I want that thing. Alright, let's take the tiny metals we got. We have to do this slowly because I don't want to fill my inventory. So, I want that octagon. And everything else. Wow, I don't think I ever need anything else from this place. Maybe like another dark egg someday so I can breed bosses. I need to do this twice more. That shark guy with the axe, that's really cool. I'm sad I saw this guy here because I wanted to, like, I would have loved to hatch an egg with that thing in it. Tiny metal. Super tens. You cannot catch enemy monsters here. Death Seed, Meteor, Smart Book, Friend Staff, Magic Key. Tiny metal. One octagon egg, please. So there's the king squid and there's the octagon. Let's go look at the octagon. It's kind of weird looking. I can breed a... I can breed this with a... With a Lion X or a Gate Guard or Evil Armor or a Chop Clown to get an Octo Raid. Chop Clown is the easiest of those to get. So let's do that. Get my Chop Clown, determine its gender. Chop Clown is, in my opinion, one of the scariest monsters in this series. Very odd and comfortable design. Yes, the chop clone can join. Let's go ahead and get this guy to level 10 before I ditch him. I wonder what his stats are like. Fighting the enemies one by one. They're not awful. Oh yeah, I never hatched the octagon. It needs to be male. Which it is. What's this thing's leveling rate? Oh, it's got garbage stats. Level 10. This thing probably has really good growth. Mm, they're okay. A lot of int. A lot of int. A lot of int. The thing will definitely cap its int if it could actually hit level 99, which it almost definitely can't. I'm not sure it would definitely cap it. In fact, I think it probably wouldn't. Hmm. 
This is a question mark monster too. Octo raid. It's pretty cool. A knight, like a spear, and octopus tentacles. It's quite intelligent too. It seems to be the stat that it's really easy to get a lot of. Scarfish is quite difficult to breed. But I don't think it's rare. Let's make a little list of what I'm missing from the water family. It might actually take much longer than I realized to breed all monsters. Petite eel. Moray. Walrus man. Ray Gigas. Anemon. Rare man. Future fish. Fish rider. Cluster, Cancer Man, Scalopia. Scalopa. Seahorse, Mer Tiger, X Shark. A lot of these are bred from each other. And I'm missing the second to last one, which is a Pumpus. I think I'm coming down with a cold. So definitely I can go catch a Scalopa and a Petrifish in the wild. I think I'll go do that now. I've actually caught a Starfish. I didn't know that. This is the worst region I could have picked. So that's a petri fish. Got it. I don't think there's anything else here I don't have. Well, I didn't even look through the overworld. I've never had that geranium thing. Geranium's a kind of flower. What that what's that thing's actual name? Ga Gamanian. There's two fish down. Oh shit, I have had that thing. Why not catch it? Hmm, fuck. Oh well, it'll be good for breeding. It's good to have lots and lots of fish. I think I've caught everything else in that region. <coughs> Excuse me. Mouse on screen. There you go. These guys never ever fight. This region does not appear to have any fish that I have not caught.
Whoa, that's a uh, Regigas, right? I think. Yep. So that's just this is a region for um fish type enemies, I forgot. So I should just be able to find some stuff. I think I caught one of those. <gasps> that's that's probably a cancer man, right? Maybe. It's some variety of it's a cluster. Oh, I know what a cancer man looks like actually. There's no way to release monsters in this game. The only way to actually thin down your team is to um breed. Huh. Let's try our luck on the ocean. Well there's that clam guy. Motion in the ocean. Scalopa. Lots of trouble. Lots of bubble. He was in a jam with a giant clam. Dun 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 dun. dun. I have never caught that thing. That's an amen am am amenon. Must be some kind of pun on uh, anemone. Now it makes sense. Anemone. So I just caught uh, this thing and this thing and one of these. And also one of these. It looks like the rest re require breeding to some degree. Let's see if we can't make some of them with my existing fish. Lobster, rock lobster, lobster. Ah. Merman is water plus devil, that's really easy. Fish rider is Angleron plus pixie, demonite, skull rider, or gremlin. That's annoying but not difficult. That is irritating, but not difficult. Cancer Man is two clusters, or a cluster plus any devil. I should have a devil. But the right gender is a completely different question. See what else we can make. Seahorse. Petite eel and any dragon or any devil. I need two petite eels. Merman plus gulp beast or mad cat. Oh, that's annoying. I guess I should just get the mad cat egg because that's three tiny miles. That's not too bad to get. Egg shark is cancer man plus battle rex or arc demon. Ooh, that's kind of bad. And the pumpus is a water plus mad goose. So, are any of my waters female? No, literally none of my waters are female. I need to catch a female mad goose, which should be really, really easy. Look, I've already done it. Male mad goose, female mad goose. So I need two petite eels. That's my current objective. And then I need like two devils too. There's my pumpus. 
Share hatchet. Oh, it's this thing. That's a pumpus. That thing is cute. It's affable. I should have a playthrough where I only use water mounds. That'd be kind of fun. Why do my monsters fuck up the thing I want to catch first? One down. Hello. Two down. So I think I need to breed one of them with a material. And the easiest material to get would probably be... Not material, with a devil. The easiest devil would probably be Chop Clown. There's an angler on. That would be a waste. Wow, that's an angler on. I didn't realize it was that easy. I do have a devil. So let's just do that. Where is my goopy? So I caught the pumpus. And I got the seahorse. Fish rider is Angleron plus Pixie, so I need to go find a Pixie of either gender. Uh. Cancer Man is Closter plus Closter, so I need to catch a Closter of the opposite gender of the one I already have. Mer Tiger is Merman plus Gold Beast or Mad Cat. It's going to take a little bit of effort. Egg Shark is Cancer Man plus Battle Rex or Arc Demon. So here's Seahorse. It's cute. It's like among the cutest monsters I've run into so far. I remember when they announced Skrelp. I was like all hype as hell. Skrelp was like, Skrelp was my favorite monster design of Gen 6. And I never even, I got Y just to get Skrelp, and then I never got Skrelp at any point during the game. Water types are just like, it's easy to go the whole game without getting that many water types. Because it was fishing only, and it was surprisingly late game. And I was so hyped for a Skrelp. That's the thing that really pissed me off. I got really excited to catch a Skrelp. And like, I couldn't find one. And... I like looked up where they were eventually and it was just like wow that's really late game. It made me upset. Cluster mail. Well, I don't remember what my existing one is. It's obviously female cuz all my water monsters are female. Question is how do I change this thing's gender. I can breed it with my pumpus. Yeah. Pumpus is kind of rare, though. I don't think I'll need this for anything else. I'd rather just use my seahorse. No. Angler? No, I need that, too. Is the seahorse useful for literally anything? 
No. No, the seahorse is not useful for literally anything. So it's a female seahorse, I can just use it. It's male, of course. There are so many ways you can go through this game. So many different monsters. Each playthrough is going to be so unique. Pokemon does that too. Pokemon's replay throughout value is through the roof because you can always just like use mons you've never used before. You can go through the game with a Rattata if you want to. Derived so and so from the skills it learned. Huh, it apparently knew the combination for Evil Slash or something. Speed up plus. No. I don't know. That's weird. Alright, now I need to use this female water to breed a closter and alright, it needs to be female. Don't you know it? I need to get this guy to level 10. Whoa, he levels fast. Alright, this one might be a question mark type monster. This is a Cancer Man. There we go. Oh, hi, Beth. Hey, D-Wednesday. Did you see Beth movie night? I don't remember seeing you there. So I actually need Cancer Man. Cancer Man is used to breed a hood squid. And an axe shark. So I need an Arc Demon of opposite gender. Arc Demon is Gigantus plus what? King Slime. That's fine. I can actually use a Metal Drag, which I think I already have one, but... Metal Drag might be useful for other stuff. So I'd like to hold off on producing one. I might need a Metal Drag to make, like, a Lava Man or something. Gigantus plus King Slime. Yeah, this can get hatched. So, that's a Cancer Man. I admit I've never seen that. It is not the thing I was expecting it to be. There's a monster called Cancer Man in Dragon Quest Seven, but it's just a... Uh, there's two monsters, one called uh, Cluster and one called Cancer Man, and neither of, them, neither of them are the two monsters in this game. They're palette swaps of each other. We watched um, Kung Pao Into the Fist and Arashi no Yonani. It was cute. We had a good time together. I can always just have another bath movie night. I will even have them at varying times since my sleep schedule is not always about um, nights as actual nights. Also, I've got a cold and I'm not looking forward to work tonight. It's going to be one of those days, I can tell. That's a lot of nuts! That'll be four bucks, baby! Kung Pao is a shitty movie that I love. Oh yeah, I was gonna go catch a... Gigantis plus King Slime combo. I don't know if I ever caught a Momonja. Well, there's a Gigantus, anyway. <sighs> I'm out of sirloins.
minutes. No, I haven't seen Kung Fury. And there's a bunch of level ups to resolve. Yes, this is just bad in general. He's learned a lot of skills. Alright. Let's go get some sirloins. Fuck the sage rock. Excuse me. Fifteen sirloin should suit my needs plenty. He knows all the cuts. I think charge up plus wind beast or something like that is uh here we go. Got the gigantes. Now I need the king slime. It's still in this region. Rib is fine. Let's get two king slimes. Damn it, I accidentally safe stated on that battle. Here we go. Matter of time. By attack, of course, he learns like a good skill. King slime male. You want the final one to be the middle one, I think, right? I think. I don't remember. King Slime female. Never mind. Alright, cool. So there's my ag my Dark Demon. Um, Great Log for breeding. The Arc Demon needs to be the opposite gender of this Cancer Man. I think the Cancer Man I have is male. It is. Fortunately, I hatched a female Barney the Dinosaur. was fast. I do not even need to breed this thing that I'm about to make. Cancer Man plus, there we go, X Shark. Still a cool design. Let's take the scariest thing, a shark. And give it an axe. It's boss tier. Interesting. So, got a cancer man. Got an axe shark. One of my still are, what all remains. Where are the water mons? I lost them. Unreal, I closed it. I was like done with water. Angleron plus Pixie. I have a, a devil region. My army of slimes cometh. Joker 1, I don't like that much. Joker 2 I thought was great. I don't think I beat Joker 1. Joker 2 I beat the fuck out of. I never succeeded in beating a Stark, though. A Stark was too hard for me. I never bred all the monsters or anything. I do not know why I came here. I need to find... What's the Devil region? I've forgotten. Is this area, like, Devils plus... 
No, this is this is water plus trees. Misty. Secret bird I think is all birds. Pit. Sounds like it would have some devils here and there. Those are all bugs and slimes. I know I have a devil region. Okay, that's a devil. Alright, I need to find a pixie. Are you a pixie? What are you? What are you? That's a pixie. This is a gremlin. This would be fine, too. I got it. The gremlin needs to breed with a... Angleron. So what kind of... I already forgot it, it's gender. Genders need to have more differentiated male names so that they retain... I retain them in my short-term memory longer. Wow, this thing has really good stats for level 1. Holy shit, its growths are pretty good too. That's a pretty good fish. I feel like the best monsters are the bird ones. I feel like it's easiest to have a really good playthrough with bird monsters because they level so fucking fast. And there's like they're not bad insects. Most insect mons are not that good. Angleron plus Gremlin equals fish rider. Joker. Breeding is synthesis, yeah. It makes more sense, honestly. This, the breeding just takes away your monsters for no particular reason. Synthesis combining them is a better, like, in-universe explanation. But it's the same thing. Alright, what's the thing I just made? Ooh, it's cool. Fish Rider. I guess that's correct. So that's that one off the list. So we got Merman and Mer Tiger. So I think you get a Merman with a very simple breed. Water plus Devil. Um and then Merman is used to make Mer Rider. Mer Tiger. So I need a Mad Cat. I need three tiny metals. And I also need a, um, we hope you do well. Brought along a level one, fuck yeah. Smart book, death seed, magic key, life ring, tiny metal. Hopefully these will fill my inventory and then I can refill my money stockade. <laughs> Having to constantly come, yeah, that's annoying. I actually don't like that about um, Dragon Warrior monsters. There's a Mad Cat. Soon it will be mine. Fortunately, there's enough Pokemon that it's quite easy to name them after Pokemon. Oops, I ran out of money. I mean room. All right, let's take the moment to generate some money. For some reason, that line isn't skipped with auto fire. For some reason, it wasn't showing up when I was doing one v ones. Well, I've recouped some of my... whoops. Did I game over? It looked like it took an extra long time that one time. That should be it. I should be fucking loaded. 
Yep. Now I've got to make room for one additional. Antipasta, huh? Tiny metal, please. I really should, like, start fucking around with some of these, um, um, magic keys. <laughs> So before I finish this game, I need to not forget to unlock the other ti the magic keys, the unique ones. And I need to not forget to uh, generate the um, monsters that are not in, in the game. Oops, I accidentally put away the rib. I hate this area. One mad cat egg. I might need that servant at some point. So this mad cat needs to be the opposite gender of the merman I breed. In order to breed a merman, I have to breed Devil plus water. I do not have a devil. So I've got to go catch a devil, which is in White Pit. Hack Seed. Those are not devils. It was in the red ocean, I think. There we go. Yeah. So, any devil will do. That is a devil. I want the pixie, actually, because I've never got one. Show me the pixie. Also, if I could catch a female devil, that would just be swell. Oh, I got one. Female and a pixie. That was fortunate. Um, I'll use my basic water bitches. No reason not to. Peach or fish is easy to reproduce. There's the merman. Um, what do I need to breed it with? Oh, the mad cat, that's right. Female. Also female. The mad cat is in Dragon Quest V. It is a boss in that game, and also a character. I was just kidding when I wrote those, don't worry. But for what it's worth, my retro stuff gets like um, 10 views. My fighting game stuff gets hundreds, if not thousands.
Same growth rate. Alright. Here's Madcap, by the way. I don't think I've shown it off yet. And there's uh, Merman. So here's a Mer Tiger. It looks stupid as fuck. Also, I've now finished the water monsters. Yep, got them all. Poseidon is rarity four. That makes sense, because you have to fucking breed a Mudo to get it. Gracos is rarity three and a half. Fin on its back is a weapon. It's another one I want to look up. Water plus spiky boy, that's way easier. Well, mage is three. Ghost king squid, three and a half. Gracos gets twin hits. Always kind of liked Gracos. All right, time to take notes for a new monster family. I guess we'll do undead now. I need to breed another White King, so I can do that at some point during this. Getting all the bugs is going to be a bitch. Ooh, I barely touched this one. Alright, list initiate. I can close water because I'm done with it. Alright. Spooky skull gone. Peter pup. Rot raven. My keyboard's so far away. Mummy. Dark crab. Dead Knight, Shadow, Sculpent, Orc, Madron, Night Whip. Whoa. Holy shit, I have not caught many of these things. Mad Spirit, Wind Merge. Reaper, Inversion, Foxfire, Capped Dead, Dead Noble, White King, Blank, Bone Slave, and then Skeletor Servant. Lazamanus, Copycat, and Pom Pom Bomb. Pom Pom! Alright. What the fuck is this? Skullgon is any dragon plus s s another Skullgon. A dead noble. A fucking white king or a servant. Are you serious? I have to waste a servant on that shit? Oh, hold on. There's other ways to read Skullgon. Any zombie plus Andriol. That's so much easier. There's a lot of ways to breed Skullgon. Uh.
Alright, let's start by getting a Skullgon and a Dead Noble, because that's... I mean, a Skullgon and a Copycat, because that's one of the ways to get a Dead Noble. And if I can get a Dead Noble, that's one of the ways to get a White King, which I need for a Lazamanus. I actually need two White Kings. I already have a Skeletor, so I just need the two White Kings. Alright, I can see how this is going to work together. A team of spookies. Yo, dude, you're right. I should make a team of spookies. I'm My throat's hella sore. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to refill my glass of water. So tell me how about this DBZ re relaunch. It's starting, it's picking up where Battle of Gods ended or something, right? And it's either ambiguously ignoring GT or outright annulling it. That's all I know. I know it's before GT, but I don't remember if it actually non-canonizes GT. I've had a skull gone. I must have caught one from like a shit. There's no point in breeding a skull gone then. Let me take another look at this. Alright, I'll breed a dead noble and a bone slave. I've never had a mad spirit. I thought I've caught many of those. I used to watch GT, and of course I've seen, I think, every episode of Z, and most episodes of Joel. Never read any of it, though. Even when I'm healthy, I only have one nostril. I got a deviated septum. Took too many punches as a kid.
Dead Noble is Mudron plus Gate Guard. Zombie plus Tungella. Sounds like the easiest way to start this. I like GT. Oh yeah, I can, dude, I can talk about Street Fighter 4 whenever. You can talk to me about fighting games no matter what I'm streaming. Honestly, it makes the conversation more engaging. People, like, you know, I'm a good source of knowledge for some fighting games. You can come in here and type literally anything, though, if you want. Just so we're in the clear about what's okay to come here and type anything. We're going to go and catch a spooky. What's the fastest undead to catch? Let's determine the tungala we need. There's a tungala. I hate having a level 1 along. Need to catch a male ghost. Do it in sky. I'll catch a gate guard while I'm there. Now you can post Hamtaro fanfic. This is going to sound hella gay, but I used to read Hamtaro fanfics. I'm not even joking. I actually used to, like, when I was, like, 10, maybe, I used to hella bra browse fanfiction.net. I used to read all the fanfics people would write. There's no frame data because for exactly that reason. Um, a, f a jump in attack can be up to about, like, plus 30. Or something quite ridiculous like that. Jumping attacks can get a lot of plus frames. It depends on whether it's a light, medium, or heavy normal. It depends on... Um... Okay, that's pretty much all it depends on. Depends on the height at which it connects. The recovery of a jump in is cancelled... Uh, what, four frames after landing? But they have the hit stun of heavy normals. And block stun. I need both of these. Of course I get three skills. Let's use a sirloin. Got a copycat. This thing is interesting. It can be bred. Not in this game anyway. I think it can be bred in the first game. This is like the ditto of this game. Actually, I don't remember what happens if you try and breed it. It might just, even if it's pedigree, just reproduce whatever you breed it with. It's kind of cute in an awful way. So I need to catch an undead thing that is male. I need to catch that gate guard. I never caught a babble, so I should catch a babble too. Vivify, useful. I always just find myself getting DP'd out of DiCaprio's Ninja Jump Hard Punch into Close Hard Punch. If you do it well-timed, um, it will be a true block string and they will be unable to DP. Just hit the button later in your jump, or hit the Fierce sooner when you land, or both. But DiCaprio's Close Fierce is kind of slow, so you have to be quite precise about it.
it is about as hard in Street Fighter 4 to combo out of a high cross-up light kick as it is in Street Fighter 3 to combo out of a, a deep jump-in hard kick. Jump-ins in older Street Fighters are quite hard to combo out of. I got a babble. This one is good to get rid of. <coughs> I need a male zombie. <coughs> Excuse me. It's going to be one of those days. That's a peach or pup female. I thought I remembered other zombies in this area. Maybe you just have to go really deep. Ghost tree is not... It's a tree. Peach or pup female. I need a male one. Excuse me. It's disgusting. There's a mad spirit. There's a peach pup male. Yeah, you can... I'm not encouraging you to jump in in footsies. But, um... Doing a jump in and then blocking and baiting out the uppercut. Can get you some really big punishes for free. So now I just need a mad spirit. Which I'm really surprised I've never caught one. Because that's like a, like a monster... That I pass by all the time. There we go. There's one. Have I not caught this thing? It's female. I get rid of my halo slime, but I like it too much. Well, I have the tree guy already. I've noticed that forward jump 2s have noticeably more hits done than forward jump 1s. It might depend on the character, but Scorpion can very comfortably do a towards 4 after a forward jump 2, but not at all after a forward jump 1. It literally doesn't work. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm just in a bad way. You definitely shouldn't be using close hard punch in that context, D Wednesday. You should use like close strong or something. Close strong is only like four frames. And the normal doesn't matter at all in that context. No, hand super is quite good. There's no reason not to try for that. That's actually optimal. It's good that you go for that. A sculpent? How do you get one? Alright, then Boudron is what I wanted. And the Moodron needs to breed with... I forgot what my objective was. A gate guard. So it needs to be the opposite gender of the gate guard I just caught. So it needs to be male. Save states really aren't helping me that much with this playthrough. They're mostly just time savers. The only thing they really help me with is catching. I haven't used, like, save states to... Um, do something really difficult in forever. That was dumb. Alright, that was easy. I really despise the idea of like trying to breed my way up to certain monsters rather than just catching my way up to them. 
Mudron plus gate guard. Mudron plus copycat also results in something strange. Does that count? Is that one of them? Oh yeah, Mudron plus copycat is uh, a dead noble. So the gate guard and the copycat both work. I need an easy way to breed bone slaves because I need a lot of them. They hard to get. Bone slave is mummy, dead knight, or hork. Plus rock slime, slime borg, landau, mad goose, flowerman, hornbeat, and gremlin. That's surprisingly annoying and difficult. Hopefully hork is not that hard. Spooky plus any beast. That's so much breeding. Why can't I just find a hork in the wild? Mummy is also kind of a chore. Dead Knight, there might be one in the wild somewhere. Let's just focus on breeding this Lazamanus. Deep breed of Gascon. Gascon is dragon plus plant. Um, no, I like MKX. It's just it's difficult for me to stream because it causes a lot of slowdown and frame drops. Um, I think the game is fantastic. I haven't been playing that much. I haven't been playing ranked. I've only been playing against my friends who also got it. So I got a female dead noble. Forgot what I actually need to breed this with. A king slime. Or an andriel actually. Should be pretty easy to get a male king slime. We watch Kung Pao and Arashi no Yon and Eat. I need a dragon and a plant and a king slime. A male king slime. The dragon can be either gender. This is a dragon. Alright, the dragon is female. The king slime must be male. Get two king slimes going. It's a female king slime. That was the left one, I think. So I need the center one. There we go. Now I just need to get lucky. Here we go. King slime. And now I need one more. I need, uh... Shit, what did I need? Dragon, King Slime, 
And a plant of any variety. I'm going to catch a gopal. The gopal needs to be male. I can ice. That's a female gopal. That's a male gopal. That babble's a piece of shit. What if there are cure slimes in this game? Alright, here we go. Dead Noble plus... King Squid? No. Was, I must have gotten boss. as White King, but that's terrible. What was I going to... Dead Noble plus what? Wasn't it King Slime? That gets me a spooky. That's not that's not what I was expecting at all. White King equals Dead Noble plus King Slime. Huh. Should have caught an Andriel. That would have worked for sure. So that one's incorrect. Oh, I'll just go catch an Andriel in a second. Needs to be a male Andriel. Let's at least get the gas gone. <sighs> Gulpal, of course! Fuck! I really didn't think this through. Gulpal, dragon plus Gulpal equals Andriel. So let's just breed a male Andriel out of this crap. which actually worked impeccably. And then I need to catch a plant that's not... Wait, hold on. Do I have a... What's the... Don't I have a plant? Don't I have the fucking... Whatever happened to the tree thing? Did I set it free? I think I did. God damn it. I'm my own worst enemy. What's a plant I can catch? A cacti. Cactus... Cacti ball. Well, wow, that's stupid. Oh well, let's go catch one. You. It's female. I need it to be... Male? I didn't do Andriel. Uh, leveling time. Oh yeah. Give me a second here. There we go. This game in too casual for me. So now I've got both these guys leveled up. Cactus thing fucking sucks. But whatever. This dead noble plus this Andriel. Results in a skull golem. What the fuck? Dead noble just can't be used to make a white king, huh? Troll me.
A blizzardy should work. I can catch a blizzardy in the wild. Dead noble plus blizzardy should work. Alright, let's breed that Gascon. Uh, did I fuck up? Yeah, I did. I did fuck up. I, I should have caught a cacti ball of the opposite gender. Oops, that was too far to go back. Or it was not far enough to go back. So let's catch... I don't want to catch another cacti ball. I'm going to catch another dandrill of anything. No, that's stupid. Fuck! I don't know what to do. I don't know how to turn my dead noble into a white king. Besides breeding with a boss, which is worst case scenario. Key to Sea World. Hell yeah. No, let's catch another Andriel. Holy fuck. Needs to be a female Andriel, that's what most of them are. Should take two seconds. Is a king slime taunting me? There we go. This Andrew on my team, like I think I think I can just ditch it. I don't want to though. This king slime ain't shit. I think I want to breed it with my metal drag. Where is my metal drag? I have one, right? Chilling somewhere. Is that a fucking spot slime? I've been booting all these rare monsters from my team. I do have a metal drag. I've just got a spot slime chilling somewhere. Please, let me make from these two monsters. I need a gas gun. There we go. Gascon is... I had to read it with the copycat. Dragon Quest... You could make a Dragon Quest game in RPG Maker, but it would be insanely hard. I used to, I used to make games in RPG Maker 2000 all the time. I was like the RM2K master. My brother was, okay, was actually much better at it than I was, but we used to like devote a bunch of time to that. We used to be RPG making fiends together. Help me design some monsters, what would I do? That'd be useless. Make a Metal King. Um, Metal King plus Dead Noble should be good. My Dead Noble is female, yeah. My coffee cat is female. So both these monsters being male is just fine with me. Wait. My Gascon. I need to hatch my Gascon. With my coffee cat. My Gascon needs to be male. It's female. Gascon is like... It's like the inflation fetish monster. It's like the Andrew Dobson monster of this game. There it is. I feel like there's a lot of potential for monster designs. I feel like you could make unique monsters no matter what. This one's got boss tier levels. This one's got very quick ones. Alright, hopefully we should get some serious breeding down in a second here. We're about to make a pom-pom bomb. At least I've got that one down. That one's going to happen. I really can't stand Andrew Dobson and his inflated sense of self-importance. That one always gets me when people talk about Andrew Dobson's inflated sense of self-importance.
So, copycat. There we go, there's a pom pom bomb. This is supposedly quite rare. Oh, it's this thing! I remember this thing. This is an enemy in uh, 7. It's in um, Dharma. I don't think it's this one. I think there's a, like, a yellow one. I think there's palette swaps of this guy. This is a pom pom bomb, huh? So hopefully in some universe, Dead Noble Plus... Why is it a spooky? Why? Why is it a spooky? Why can I not turn my Dead Noble into fucking a White King? A Skullgon... Might be the fastest way to do it. Pom pom! There's something else I was going to breed too. There's a shadow. A rot raven. I can do a lot of just generic breeding to get some of the monsters I need. See this? That would be fine. I want to do the rare breeds first though because those are the ones. Ah, this random servant I have just chilling here. I'm pretty sure you can turn a servant into a white king without too much trouble. Never mind. Ha! Ha! I forgot about that. I actually need to do this. I need a Draco Lord. I forgot that I had the Servant plus the Andriel combo. Now I need the the White King. But I don't know how to make the White King. It says here Skullgon plus Skullgon plus Andriel will work. Or Skullgon plus Metal King. Let's give ten let's tentatively give Skullgon plus Metal King a try. Let's make a fucking Skullgon. Oh yeah, that's right, I just bred away my fucking dragon. God, this game gets you. I don't want to use a genocide over an Ashurazoma just to fucking make some stupid ass thing. I have an Andriel. I forgot that I had another one. I didn't know this thing was undead. That really surprises me. There's nothing undead about it. It looks more like a beast or something. I don't know how I'd classify this thing. It doesn't really look like it has an element. The monster designs in this game are fantastic. All of the monsters have really cool designs. I have a lot of the late game ones, so these are some of the cooler designs. But a lot of the early ones are really cute, so it's not like they're it's not like they're ever bad. Look at that thing. That is my male Halo slime. So let's go catch a fucking. A male dragon, I suppose. Be the easiest way about this to make a skull gone. That is not a dragon. That is also not a dragon. These are not dragons either. There's a dragon. It might be male. Nope. That's a dragon. Nope. He just learned beat. Same battle. I 
I think this one's male. I think the one with the mad goose. Yep. Um. This pom pom bomb, I never realized how skinny they were. They look really fat and round. Breed the dead noble with the dragon to make a skull gone. Needs to be male, I think. Now I'm going to attempt to breed it with a metal king. The metal king is male. So this thing needs to be female. Which it is. Alright, I'm not going to make any save states until I determine the true nature of this Skullgon. Fire slash and ice slash, huh? Why do I care? Clean cut and aqua cut? This thing has hella skills. Suck all sucks. Appropriately. If this isn't a white king, I'm going to cry. It's a spooky. Why? Why are all the white king fucking breeding things wrong? White king is supposedly a Skullgon, or Dead Noble, or Bone Slave, or Skeletor. Plus a Spot King, King Slime, Metal King, Andriel, Great Drake, Blizzardy, Zapbird, Whipbird, or Gold Golem. I can just do Zombie plus Boss. I could use like Zombie plus Dark. That would actually probably be the easiest way to do it at this point. Sadly. Or I could just catch a White King from like an enemy Monster Master. Which would definitely be the easiest way to do it at this point. Let's breed a fucking sculpt, I guess. What is a sculpt? Ooh, it's spooky. Scary. Skeleton. And it's sending shivers down my spine. No, I don't want to do this. Let's never even breed the dead noble. <laughs> 